truthfully, like there's no excuse for this United team not to be in the top four with how Spurs and Villa have sort of played over the past couple of weeks. But it's the same thing. We're just not willing to take our chance and move forward. Luckily, we have a pretty decent run of games moving forward. But it's like we played Coventry at the weekend, a team that's in the league below. I, I don't necessarily have a ton of confidence even going into that game. So yeah. same thing we've been saying for a while, fellas, lack of consistency. Yeah, I um, we've made it to – we're recording this right now, basically 7 p.m. on Monday night. Um, I was convinced that Ten Hag was going to get sacked today. I was about to ask uh, you. Yeah, and, and – and, and the thing is, the thing is, is right after the Bournemouth game, I did put in the group chat. I don't agree with it um, because I still believe that Ten Hag's the right guy, but I just think that United's going to get to the point where they are going to sack him before the end of the season, and I don't agree with that. Um, I I do think that there's so much that needs to happen behind the scenes. There are so many players that need to not be at the club anymore. Um, and I just think that he's going to get the sack before we get the chance to see that happen. Um, so I'm glad that I made it to Monday and that still hasn't changed. 